Hey guys, what's up? It's Jake here, coming at you with another video. Um, today we're the server unboxing, so I finally got it. I finally ended up getting it um, in the mail. It is shipped from Orange Computers. They're a really good eBay seller. They got this to me in two days, so I'll probably be in the shot a bunch of times um, just because it's a big unboxing. It's really hard to just do, so I taped out my stuff. Um, right here I opened there's a second box so I didn't feel like taping off like the dress and crap so right here's the R710 ears and a torque wrench um, just because they include separate because of shipping um, let me come over here I didn't unbox them yet uh, but we have two new power cords um, and two 570 watt power supply units I'll probably put one in this R710 one in the other one just for power efficiency and then also downstairs I don't have them up here I'm not gonna unbox them uh, well maybe I will in this video I don't know I got uh, some um, Xeon L uh, 5630s so they use only 40 watts of piece at max load but roughly about 20 normally so that's what I want I want a low power host with uh, this has 48 gigs of RAM um, two will have uh, 50 um, will have some uh, um, L50, you know, I, I just said that, I forgot already, I'm just trying to open this, but currently we have the Xeon, uh, dual Xeon E5, E5504s, um, and they're only a uh, 2 gigahertz um, CPU. Sorry for the background noise, uh, someone's cutting their grass, but I just gotta unbox this server, um, so, oh, we gotta cut the tape over here. I figured I wasn't even gonna do an unboxing video on this, but figured mine as well for you guys. Let's pop this open. I'm okay, so I do see the server. This also does have two 15k SAS drives and blanks. That's awesome. I didn't know if they're gonna include blanks or not. Um, so here, let me. Sorry for the little bit of movement that will happen here. I try to make it very unnoticeable. If we take a look in here, um, we got our drives. This is the two, uh, small form factor edition. And they did get us blanks, which is awesome. This looks in really good condition. Um, as you can see here, this is like, shows all the info and that they tested everything. So let me just pull this out of the box. I'm not gonna record this part. I'm um, just because it's really hassle. Um, and then I'll show you the server itself. Okay guys, after some configuration, put the ears on as you can see, um, did hook up a power supply and put on this back brace thing, um, everything's hooked up. The one problem I do have with this unit is if you look, uh, they shipped it and in shipping this must have cracked. So the guy's just sending me a new LCD, so it's whatever, it's just a temporary thing. But uh, if we look here, um, these two drives are 146 gigabyte SAS drives that it came with, um, that I bought, purchased separately. Um, so we're just gonna pop that in. Pop this one in, and it came with blanks, which it didn't show, which was nice. Um, so let's get to first boot. Hopefully, okay, so we do have something as you can see in the server. Sorry if it's really loud. Um, we have dual CPUs and uh, six eight gigabyte DIMMs. So. Also that RAID controller back there. This is a 570 watt power supply by the way. We do see Dell R so it's the latest BIOS, so it should accept my new CPUs. Uh, I didn't do an unboxing unfortunately of that, but here they are. So I'll install those. I just want to make sure the unit works. Uh, so I'll get back to you with some more details. Hey guys, um back for the last part of this video um, we did get the R710 in as you can see here's my um, other R710 my 3.5 inch 
version of the R710. As you can see, that kind of annoys me, but we are getting another one of these in. Um, it's going to be overnighted, so that's cool. Um, the seller just sent me a new one, so that's nice. Um, as you can see, there are two 146GB 15K SAS drives in running in a RAID 0. Um, just because this is just for test and our production currently. Um, Switch is uh, has eight ports loaded because uh, we have four Ethernets for each uh, host. I might give you a look around back um, real quick. So looks you know pretty nice I guess. I um, mean also I wanted to show you this um, this R710 came with these procs on um, these two. Um, there's two in this thing. Um, but I don't know if you can see it. Um, but these are L uh, fifty uh, L fifty five twenties. Um, but these are sixty watt CPUs, and uh, there's still only two point um, two point. Let's see, two six gigahertz. Where I installed the um, the other CPUs that I bought, the L fifty six thirties, which are. 2.13 gigahertz, so you take a gigahertz lost, but let me show you the power consumption. I'm with two, two 15k, two and a half inch SAS drives, I'm 48 gigs of RAM, pretty much all NICs loaded, uh, running off a 570 watt power supply. We are only pulling roughly, see if we can get some, if I can get some light, I know this is just, this is temporary, less than 100 watts most of the time, max it'll go up to 100. But usually, when I'm not running too much on it, it stays about 90 watts, which is absolutely insane. Um, so for, uh, I think I'm gonna put uh, change the E chips in this one. This is the on E uh, 55 something, but I'm gonna put the another set of L um, 56 uh, 30s because I don't really need the CPU power. We need RAM and disk space um, because. You never use that much CPU power, at least in my case here, um, I haven't used that much CPU power. Um, so yeah, then we can run these both for the same waters that I'm pulling from just this one. So that's, you know, 200 watts for two hosts, that's extremely good when this one's pulling about 150 to 170 right now. So we can have two times the power for the same energy consumption, which will be nice. So uh, if you have any guys have any questions. I will be doing a ton of videos on setup for things on these, uh, especially this server, because this one's pretty much configured, but we're going to run um, primary and backup servers and all that stuff, and I'm going to do videos on that. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. Please rate, comment, like, subscribe. I'll see you next week, guys. Peace out.